member choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I want to thank God for making me a, a choosing and my family a choosing. Thank choosing you, praise Father. The Lord. I want to appreciate the name of God for what he did just recently. Um, my husband and I started um, a project, a production company, which was registered in May 2019. And um, I've been handling this project. So uh, shortly after the lockdown, I was hoping to launch the product and we ran out of funds. So we, we were believing God of choosing to do something. Two, um, second to the last Thursday in January, when I came for deliverance service, uh, Gio that day was just saying, you know, during his prayer, he was saying, today is very good. Today is a good day. And in my heart, it was difficult for me to believe that actually that day was a good day. And then, not that I was doubting my Gio, but because of that burden, I needed to launch this product. I told God, I said, this January, I must launch this product. So Gio prayed, and as if he heard my discussion in my mind, he now said, there's someone here, there's a project, you're handling a project, and let God of choosing intervene. And then Amen. I believed God for that, and the power of God hit me. So after that, God of choosing provided funds for us to complete the project. Power. Choosing praise the Lord. Thank you, Father. From the top of my head, you know, um, the, the value should be about 8 million naira. And God provided every cobble that we needed and even more. Choosing praise the Lord. Shall we clap unto God and appreciate him? The God of choosing answers prayers. My second testimony is about my mom. My mom came to choosing by God's grace through me. And then um, immediately she joined choosing. She has been an intercessor, a prayer warrior in her former church. Her pastors fought and they didn't want her to go. So she joined choosing. And you know how it is. They started making, you know, as if they wanted to make trouble. That why is she leaving them? Is it that they're not uh, praying well or what? But something happened during this uh, sorrow to joy. She camped, you know, in their branch for days before sorrow to joy. And immediately after Soro to Joy, she went back home, only for her to get home. And she called me around 10 the next day when, when she got home. She said she came home and she tried to rest. As she was resting, she dozed off. And when she dozed off, she noticed that there was a movement into her compound. And then she was wondering, ah, who is this? Who is this person? Where are you going to? And by the time she tried to open her eyes, she opened her eyes and she couldn't see again. She just went black, blank. And she couldn't see. She blacked out. And she tried to open her eyes and she couldn't see. She now called me and, see, and said, see what happened to me now? I said, well, we just came back from sorrow to joy. And me, I have no space again for sorrow in my life. And so you don't have any space for sorrow. And then don't believe the report. She said, ah, but she can't see. I said, don't worry. You will see. Because a woman just who was blind from birth just got healed. So you cannot come back from sorrow to joy and you become blind. So till evening, she called me again and said, I still cannot see. I'm still inside the house. I said, it's not your portion. So I gave, uh, I gave her number to one of my branch pastors. I said, Pastor, please pray for my mom. She said she cannot see. This is what happened. So immediately the pastor prayed for her. She said, oh, I can see, I can see. She started seeing the chairs. Clap your hands unto God of the chosen. Apparently, apparently the, the, whoever that came into the compound, I don't know what they came to do, but the spirit immediately left her. And she said, oh, she can see, she can see the chairs, she can see even the compound, and the, all the fruits that grew in the compound. She said, ah, I can see them now. But, you know, for, for some time, she couldn't see anything. She just blanked out. So that was how God of choosing intervened in that matter. Choosing praise the Lord. clap unto God and appreciate him? The God of choosing is so great. At this point, I really want to pray for my Gio. I want to pray that this God that called him 
at this time will continue to uphold and strengthen him in Jesus' name. Amen. I pray for heaven at last for him and our mommy in the Lord. I pray for all his family members and every choosing member. I pray heaven at last in Jesus' name. Amen. I pray for me and my family, heaven at last in Jesus' name. Amen. I cover my testimonies with the blood of Jesus Christ. Blood of Choose Jesus. Him, praise the Lord. Let's clap unto God and appreciate him. The last testifier for today. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Choosing people praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Please, sir, let me render song to God. Yes, go ahead. He's a miracle worker. He's a miracle worker. The Lord I answer when I call. He's a miracle worker. God of chosen answer when we call. He's a miracle worker. Chosen praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My name is Ikechi Lazarus. I thank God for making me and my family a chosen. Thank you, Father. I joined Choosing 2009. I recite at Ago number one, Unitire Street, Ago. Choosing, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My testimony, I'm here to give this testimony on behalf of my husband. My husband based in Asian country, outside the country. One day he called me that he had a police case there, and they took this matter to court. Then the judge that handled the case started delaying this case. Anytime my husband go to court, the judge will adjust this case. For more than getting to four years, nothing. My husband was suffering in the hand of this judge because the judge is a, in the other religion. And my husband is a Christian, being a chosen. So one day, even the coordinator of Dubai, uh, Pastor Emeak, he always prayed for my husband. He called him, encouraged him. He said, don't worry, God of choosing will prove his power. He called me too and prayed for me. Because since then, this God of you have a father. I called my daddy G.O. One of my in-laws sent daddy G.O.'s number. I called daddy. Our daddy prayed. Choosing people. Our daddy prayed. Yes, so. Hmm. The judge that delayed that case, then called that judge to the high court to bring that file, that particular case. That judge, then tell that judge that there's no case in this file, that he should set this man free to go. Hey, hey, hey. Choosing people. Thank you, Father. Immediately, the judge set my husband free. Hallelujah. Choosing people. Do you know what happened? This God of choosing. Tell us the, what happened. They called the, the same that judge that handled that case to that high court. They say, Why do you take bribe to so so person? They sent that judge to 25 years imprisonment. Power! He's in prison. Touch not my anointed and do my prophet no harm. Touch not my anointed and do my prophet. Touch not my anointed, touch not my anointed and do my prophet no harm. Touch not my anointed and do my prophet no harm. Touch not my anointed and do my prophet no harm. Touch not my anointed and do my prophet. Touch not my anointed, touch not my anointed and do my prophet no harm. Touch not my anointed and do my prophet no harm. Amen. People praise the Lord. If we go and meet we Jesus there and become born again inside prison. After all, many of these leaders, it is when they get to prison, they repent and become born again. Some of them will die so that they will not backslide. Some of them will come out having learned serious lesson. Praise the Lord. So it's a good plan from God. Choose and praise the Lord. Hallelujah. You see, we really have a great father in this place. Yes. If not the prayer of my G.O., I don't know. Today, I don't know what will happen to my husband. Because the judge knows that he's a Christian. And he probably wants to suffer him there. Now he's testing what he wants to do to my husband. He Choosing kept him people. for four years. I, 
four years, in fact, it's noisy. It's because of the case that I locate to this Lagos. That when my Geo prayed, I know that one day the matter will solve. And, and one day, Geo prayed. Yes. And that one, one day, day did not pass day. you by. Yes. Sir. And the matter was solved. Yes. Clap your hands unto God of the choosing. Hey, hey. I like the faith of our sister. She said, one day, Gio will pray. And that one day, the matter will solve. I want you to be patient. Gio will soon come out now to pray. And as he pray today, that your matter will be solved today. And sister's problem did not pass one day. Today is that one day for you. And as our Gio pray, today, 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 that your matter will be solved. Clap your hands unto God of the choosing. Choosing, praise thy Lord. Hallelujah. So that day after God, after my geo prayed, everything now settled. Then my husband, for my husband to come back to Nigeria, you know, COVID of a 10. So they took him to test. They say his temperature was high, in BP was high. I still sent test to my geo. My daddy geo prayed again. Power. <laughs> my geo prayed again. And my husband go back to the test. They say everything is normal. Power! Jesus, the Lord. Clap your hands unto God of the choosing. During our uh, sorrow to joy, I was in this program that they been on six, that first day of the program. My phone rang. Choosing people. My husband called me that is in Abuja. Today he's in Nigeria. Choosing he's in Nigeria. <laughs> Thank you, Father. Yes. So I'm here to appreciate this great God of choosing. It's good to have patience. It's turn by turn. Amen. Because if I don't have patience, hey, I don't know what will happen. Because my husband people was encouraging him that I should come to their church. I should come their pastor. They even give one of the biggest church, the, the GO to call. My husband said, no, if not the choosing pastor, I don't want anybody to pray for him. That nobody should take him to any church. He even warned me that I should stay put. That I know the God that is sound. Correct. Today, God of choosing have set him free. Now he's in Nigeria with me today. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. I, re I promise God that if this matter solved, that I will give God, me and my husband will give God 70,000. So I'm here with this 70,000 to appreciate this God of choosing. Thank you, Father. Let's clap unto God and appreciate him. Clap your hands unto God of the choosing. I'm here. I want to pray for my daddy, G.O. My daddy. You will live with us, Amen. my daddy, and you will make heaven at last in Jesus' name. Amen. You will finish your ministry well and mommy in the name of Jesus. Amen. Right? Our daddy and mommy and his family will be visible in the eyes of their enemies in the name of Jesus. Amen. He that call him, uphold him, we strengthen him, Amen. we be with him, we speak to him day and night in Amen. the name of Jesus. Amen. And I pray for all the choosing one worldwide including me and my family, heaven at last, in Jesus' name. Amen. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Let's clap unto God and appreciate him. Amen. All the chorus leaders should remember their meeting coming up on the 24th of February. That is tomorrow. Wednesday. I don't know the venue. Maybe they know the venue. 